All right, hello, my name is Kanaya, and this is gonna be my new YouTube channel for like lifestyle vlogs, fashion, hair, and etc. What you see right here is me looking crazy, about to wash my hair, and the first step I took was to just simply rinse my hair. The goal is to fully get your hair wet, and then afterwards, as you're going to see, I'm going to do a curl check to make sure that my hair was actually fully wet. Alrighty, now what you see right here is I'm just doing a finger detangling, which I know I don't do all the time because for me, it actually causes more breakage if I don't use my comb. So that's why I'm just taking the time right here to do a finger detangle, which I'm going to finish rest off camera. Okay, now we're about to shampoo our hair with almond and I think it's shea butter. I think that's how you pronounce it. But now you're just going to shampoo your roots only not your ends that's what i was trying to demonstrate in this video you're just going to get your fingers and scrub your scalp edges and the back of your head a lot of people neglect the back of their head because they cannot see it but you have to make sure you get that part because you do grow a lot of hair back there it might seem shorter but you know it's in the back so yeah Now we're just gonna get our wide shower tooth comb and detangle our hair. I put this in not really to show you how to comb your hair. It's more for content reasons, I'm not gonna lie. But I just try my best to start from my roots, sorry, from my ends to my roots. And I know it seems like I'm being really rough. I promise I'm not, you know hair is soft. And my facial expression is like that because I'm 5'8", and I'm bending over in the shower. So it was not fun for me, but that's all we're doing right now at this time. All right, now you're about to see me use one of my favorite products, which is the Maui Moisture Shea Butter um, Hair Mask. All you do is you just leave it in your hair for 10 minutes while you're in a shower. Ideally, when you know the steam is going so it can really like soak up in your hair, you know? So that's what your bird is gonna be doing at this time. And I'll be right back. Okay, so now we're just rinsing the hair mass out of our hair with warm to a little bit of hot water. I'm going to definitely admit that. Yep, at this time, we're just running our fingers through our hair, making sure the product is out. And at this time, I had Tyler talking to me. So <laughs> that's what's going on with that. Just continuously talking to me. And I'm just rinsing my hair. So I'll be right back after we're done with this whole conversation and rinsing hair process. Okay, so now we're using the Suave Shea Butter and Almond Conditioner. We're just placing that in our hair. And then, yeah, I have a little problem where I really don't like water in my eye or in my face. I'm gonna start panicking. And that's unfortunately what you're seeing here is me panicking. But while the camera was off, all I did was put the conditioner in my hair. I let it sit for 10 minutes and I'm rinsing it out right now. I know I cut that part out, but that's definitely what happens. 
And now I'm just letting you guys see the texture of my hair after I did shampoo, hair mask, and conditioner. And that's where we're at right now with this hair routine. All right, so now I am out of the shower. I apologize. I know this routine seems a little long, but I promise in reality it's not. At this time, all I'm doing is just getting hair products on the counter and just conversating again with Tyler. And that's it. Okay, so now I have my wide tooth comb again, and I'm just gonna be parting my hair detangling that is what I had come out of my hair after a shower I'm trying my best to retain retain length so in my opinion I was very sad about all of that hair that came out but it happens hair grows and falls out every single day and you do not know it Okay, so right here, I don't know the name of the product off the top of my head, but it's my favorite uh, growth oil. It does not make my scalp itch absolutely at all or nothing in that sort. So what I'm going to be doing is just placing the oil in my hair. I don't, I really don't section my hair in like, you know, four to eight parts and just thoroughly place the oil in my hair it's most likely just random spots where I feel like it's spaced out enough as you see me demonstrating I'm just winging it especially in the back of my head since unfortunately I'm not able to see that I definitely go ahead and put oil on my edges that's always important to me because a lot of people have uh, breaking edges because they don't show any attention to the edges what I'm definitely trying to avoid in this case. Okay, so now we're just finishing up putting oil in the back of our head as much as we can and now we're just going to take all 10 fingers and just try our best to rub that into our scalp it's more of just you know just a gentle motion nothing crazy in that sort yes and i am branding myself multiple times throughout my videos so stay tuned for that but now we're back to the hair tutorial or more of a routine and I'm just looking at my hair because I really do wish I could just wear my hair like this to work but unfortunately the word shrinkage is absolutely real so I would not be able to wear my hair like this to work so I'm just making sure everything looks correct and even and then now here I'm just taking forever to think about what I want to do with my hair unfortunately again All right, so with this part, I went ahead and just sped this clip up because it was just me just honestly messing around with my hair. I had absolutely no clue what to do with my hair because I was trying my best not to put it in my boring two puff balls per usual. So that's just what's going on right here. But at the end, I actually like the back ponytail a lot. So that's what I went with. Okay, so when it comes to this part, I was not able to find a brush at all in the house to brush down my ponytail. So what I do when this happens is I just get a hair scarf, put it on, lay down, wake up, and my hair is flat. 
and I actually love the back ponytail a lot which I'm showing you from most angles that I could and that is that all right thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe if possible please like comment and share and I love feedback a hundred percent thank you so much for watching